All right, a look now at our upnorthlive.com forecast. A very active week coming up in the weather department and uh, across northern Michigan. We actually have the potential for some accumulating snow. We certainly have some rain in the forecast, also the potential for some freezing rain and sleet, all because of a system off to the south. And before we get into this, I just want to kind of give you a brief setup on this. We have an area of high pressure dragging in cool air uh, up sitting up around Hudson Bay. There's a warm front that sits down across Indiana, Ohio, and Illinois, and it will waver through here the next few days. That separates 60s and 70s and very moist air from the dry, chilly air, and we will be in that cooler air here on the north side of that frontal boundary. So that's kind of the setup, and what will happen the next few days is periods of rain and precipitation will pass through the area and as we stay cool there will be a variety of precipitation types out there. But we start our Monday with rain. Low pressure over Iowa will track across southern Michigan Monday afternoon. That will lift this area of rain into lower Michigan through the day on Monday. But it will be warm enough on Monday at least where this will be just rain with uh, just plain liquid form. We're looking at cloudy skies in the UP. Most of this will actually will miss the UP to the south. We may see a little freezing drizzle there late tonight. Here's our Tuesday quiet weather. Actually, Tuesday shaping up to be one of the quieter days this week. Fairly cloudy. Another round of precipitation will sweep in on Tuesday evening, right around sunset. This will bring some rain downstate, but note the rain and freezing rain potential that will sweep in. And then the real messy weather gets in here on our Wednesday. This is the situation Wednesday morning. This is snow heavy snowfall across Wisconsin that will work into lower Michigan along with freezing rain and sleet with rain downstate where temperatures will actually be in the 60s. Hard to believe, a very typical but very ominous spring type storm system. And this will work across northern Michigan Wednesday afternoon. Here's the thing with this. This is still several days away, at least a couple of days out yet. And this is kind of a snapshot of the latest data that we have available right now. So if there's any fluctuation in that warm front to the south, then this could either be lifted north or south, correspondingly adjusting where most of that precipitation will fall. It's something we'll watch closely. We could see another round on Thursday, so a very wet week upcoming. High temperatures, here they are for your Monday, 40s locally with rain. But look closer to that front, 60 down at Detroit, 64 at Chicago, with temperatures falling back into the 30s overnight. As for icing, nothing out there on Monday because, again, we're just looking at plain rain. But as we go into Tuesday, there's the potential for some icing here, freezing rain, with possibly an ice storm in Iowa and southern Wisconsin. And the setup on the snowfall right now favors, again, our central counties. This will get in here. There's our clock ticking away. On Wednesday, we could see a stripe of accumulating snow here right across the heart of our viewing area. A closer look at this, again, showing the snowfall right there where we could see anywhere from, if, if this plays out correctly, six to eight inches on the very high end. But again, that is far from certain at this point. This is just kind of a general idea of what could happen on our Wednesday. So looking at the seven day forecast, there's the rain Tuesday, winding down Tuesday night into uh, the day on Wednesday. Here comes that freezing rain, snow, sleet. We could even hear a rumble or two of thunder on Wednesday. Temperatures fall back into the mid and upper 30s Thursday. Some snow possible through Thursday night. And then Friday and Saturday, things dry out. A high to start the weekend of 41.